welcome back to another video welcome back to another grocery haul so i am showing you guys everything that i received in my walmart um grocery haul this week and this is going to be for the week of january the 9th to january the 15th i think i got everything on my list except for the garlic bread and uh i think the pork tops and i think that's everything i got y'all and probably some sausages and then i have a menu plan that i was doing um starting on the 9th i'm making beef stew and rice um on that monday the 10th i'm having leftovers that tuesday i plan on having salisbury steak mashed potatoes and gravy and sweet peas and that Wednesday, uh, which will be the 12th, I plan on having shrimp, alfredo, salad, and garlic bread. I left Thursday open because I'm really not sure what I'm having. So that's a toss-up. Friday, I'm having uh, micro, mackerel patties with hush puppies and Saturday fish and grits. So, yeah, let me go over everything that I got. I think I spent around $190 um on this grocery haul so yeah let's start over here um i got my granddaughter some more nutella um yeah they went through the last one i got uh four cans of vienna sausages that's basically just for the hubby's lunch or a quick snack um i got the rosani uh fettuccine noodles and this is going to be for the shrimp alfredo that i make uh, later on this week i got a thing of pop tarts uh this is what a 16 count strawberry pop tarts for lunches or a quick snack i also got right here these little peanut butter cheese crackers that's for a quick snack I got some more black eyed peas and that's just to go back in the cabinet because you know new year's just left and i had to restock i got myself one of these rice aroni cheddar broccolis these are so good for a quick lunch or whatever quick snack i got two cans of the manwich this is just to go back in the cabinet for a quick dinner one night when i don't feel like cooking which i've gotten into the habit of not feeling like cooking which isn't a good thing i got myself i think this is a pink lady apple um i got a can of chili beans and i got some more over there so i'll show those in a minute um this was a substitute this sharp cheddar i've never tried this i think i had the craft um american cheese and i guess it wasn't available so they substituted that and right down there i got some thick cut bologna that was a substitute also got the hubby a thing of cinnamon toast crunch and got me a thing of fruit loops i got the girls some lunchables i got six of these turkey and cheddar lunchables and i got two of these what is these chicken dunks which uh i guess are like chicken fingers or something with cookies let's go around here well let's finish in the front um i got a thing of eggs uh a 12 count and also an 18 count and i thought those eggs was the ones that they substituted but it doesn't look like it i got a thing of bread and y'all i don't know why they tried me with these bananas but these are like i can't even eat these bananas so i'm gonna have to let them sit for a couple of days before they they're even edible got a thing of nutter buddies for a quick snack or whatever i got some gel um diced peaches and strawberry flavored gel i love these i love these for a quick lunch to put in my lunch a quick snack um right here i got what two cans of dark kidney beans and i got two cans i think no one can of light red kidney beans a can of black beans back here and i think i got three cans of chili beans and this is just to go back in the cabinet um i made chili this past week so what i use i'm just replacing i got two jars of alfredo sauce this is um for the shrimp alfredo that i'm making i got uh three cans of hunt's uh spaghetti sauce now this is just to go back in the cabinet 
right here i got a thing of carrots and this is going to be for uh oh this is going to be for the beef stew that i'm making this weekend i already had the potatoes and some onions um so yeah i got the girls two things of two things of gogurts i also got them these uh fruit snacks this was a substitute also i think I forgot what the count was that I got, but this was, I think I got two, or I put in my cart for two of the ones that were like, had 10 in them or something, and basically they substituted that. So let's go around here. Here is the shrimp that I got for the shrimp alfredo that's coming up in, in a recipe this week. And real quick, I got a thing of Gatorade for the hubby and the girls, those hugs, juices. Um, right here, I got two things of ground beef and a thing of ground turkey. That's for to go back in the freezer. I got some milk. This is for the girls' cereal. I got a thing of potato chips, which is what? One, two, three, four, six different, um, six different ones. Right here. Right here, I got a thing of guatly bacon. This was a substitute also. I've never tried guatly bacon, but evidently I'm going to try it this week for breakfast. And I got, let me turn, go around this way because that's upside down. Um, I got a thing of sausage, of meat lovers. I got two meat lovers. And over there, I got a sausage and gravy. The two meat lovers of mine. That's for a quick breakfast before work. The other two belong to the hubby. Um, I got a thing of broccoli, and that's for the shrimp alfredo. I got a thing of chicken strips. That's mainly for the girls. Um, what else? I got their noodles. Is this the, yeah, the shrimp-flavored noodles that they seem to love, which, ugh. I got them some more fruity pebbles. I'm almost done, y'all. I got a 10-pound bag of granulated sugar, and I got them some toaster strudels, the 12-count strawberry. I got a thing of hamburger helper. This is just to go back in the cabinet um, to replace what I used. I also got these Ritz Bits 12-pack of cookies with cheese for the girls. I got... Um, Two things of the oats and honey granola bars for them also. And last but not least, I got them a thing of macaroni and cheese uh, for count. So yeah, this is everything that I got in my grocery haul this week. And I'll probably be bringing you guys along when I cook certain stuff. So yeah, family, until the next video, you all have a wonderful day. And don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe and share the video with your friends. Love you guys. Bye-bye.